Limbo is awful. The kids think we had a huge fight and now divorcing, but that's farthest from the truth. We never fight. The kids know this. I don't know what's going on, but can Samian provide some clarity from a logical perspective in my current emotional state? I find myself caught in a whirlwind of thoughts as I navigate everything. Without her, if someone passed away, wouldn't your spouse's family be the first people you'd inform? Perhaps some past trauma has resurfaced yet. If it were me, my wife would be the first person I'd turn to for support. At the moment we are left with a voice void of information, nothing makes sense. I don't know what to do and I just sit here in limbo with the girls. We all know nothing. And no one is telling us anything and it has me worried, scare, angry at just about any emotion one can feel. In this situation, can anyone come up with something reasonable? Why would you ghost your family like this? Up provided an update, confirming that everyone was correct about the affair out. Share what I know and leave it at that. My father-in-law didn't call me last night, so eventually I contacted the police for a wellness check. As many of you suggested, this action led to a storm of issues that I won't delve into, but my wife has been having an affair for at least two years now, likely longer everyone was. Correct the other man, apparently had a heart attack on Tuesday and eventually passed away. That night for certain. My mother-in-law and it sounds like probably my sister-in-law have known about it and have been covering for her still. No contact from my wife. Not to me or the girls. Trying to keep this from them for now honestly. No idea what to do. From here that's all. I know and that's enough to just about be the end of me. Thank you for all of the help advice not sure how to move on from this news but that's it if you pray please pray for me and us now to the second update I've been recommended this by a few others just joined and have been reading through many posts when I have time mostly at night when the chaos of the day ends and then of course the brain takes over and I go through these fits of depression, then I get hit with raging anger then. Both at the same time, sleeping is nearly impossible, I aimlessly 